Or to say, I just want to uh, say I'm just proud of it. And um, it's only through a lot of hard work. So, um, okay. He's going to cry. First of all, Coach Hickman, because um, he's always been there for me, and uh, I learned more than basketball from him. Um, my teammates, I uh, wouldn't trade them for anything, and they helped me achieve more than I thought was possible. Um, to my family and friends who have always showed and given me the greatest support I could ask for. Um, to my mom, who always kept me uh, looking on the bright side. And to my dad, who never stopped believing in me. I do want to say one more thing that um Hey, she was proud. Is, um, all the coaches that talked about her, um, they would come to me. They would never say that she's a great basketball player. They say she's a great person. That's what she was proud. I appreciate you all coming out. Yeah, and, um, Got myself together now, so <laughs> <laughs> moment of uh weakness. <laughs> proud, proud, proud moment. Proud moment, proud moment. But that was I mean when coaches would come up to me, they never say what a great player, they say what a great kid. You know, always the hardest worker. You know, never I never saw her complain to a rep. Maybe the eyes roll a little bit. <laughs> a little hand motion. A little hand motion. But never complained to a rep. Um no matter what she accomplished, she always wanted more. She was always in the gym working late. Whatever her weaknesses, she worked hard at it to uh, improve and get better. And um, it's just through hard work, what she accomplished. I think she's a role model for a lot of girls that are told you're not fast enough, you're not tall enough. Um, you know, um, she wasn't always the fastest, wasn't always the tallest. She's the hardest worker out there I ever saw, so it so made me most proud. Mm -hmm. uh,